Sparky Sparks here. I have a new project this morning. So Wig She reached out to me to see if I'd like to try one of their human hair wigs. So um, they sent it to me and we're gonna unbox it together. So let's see this, I'm gonna read the details so that I get it correct. This is from Wig She and you can go on their website and find, uh, find this wig. So it's listed as wig 036 and the color is I asked for the color being um, a reddish brown bouncy wavy so we'll see if that's what it is we're going to open it together and then the length is 12 inches so probably around in here uh, the hair density is 120 percent and the it's um, lace it's lace front and heat friendly so I'll be able to curl it with a curling iron or blow dry it the cap construction is a lace front cap and the size is average and the knots are lightly bleached. So let's open it up and see what we've got here. Let me step back a little bit so you can actually see. It's a beautiful box. It's come a long ways. Um, I can tell because of the, um, oh, let's see how it opens. Some of these things I probably should have figured out off camera. Right? Uh, let's see. Hmm. Okay. Here's the name, so, oh, opens just like a, like a box of candy or you know, something nice. All right, so it comes in a beautiful bag, silk bag, which I love these silk bags. It, oh, awesome, we're gonna try it with their wig cap. This is a wig grip and it has velvet on it, so it's gonna be super nice, I can tell already. A nice thank you note. And let's see, oh, and it's even sealed. Isn't that pretty? Just the details, love is in the details, I always say. And it says, thank you. And then on the back, it says, we are honored that when it comes to style, you think of us. So that's a special touch. So awesome, awesome, awesome. Thank you, Wig She. Now let's try this on. So we'll unwrap the wig grip and we'll try this puppy on. So usually they're sealed on one end and that is the case. So let's do this, drop it out here. I'm excited. I don't know if you've worn human hair wigs before, but I have not. Since we don't know where the part's gonna be, we're just gonna slip this puppy on. It's got Velcro ends, and I think I'm just going to kind of put it, um, uh, I usually wear my hair about right there. So let's go around and I feel like a flower child a little bit. Okay, it's got a nice wide part. So we'll start with it there. So this is what it looks with just the wig grip. You know that normally I wear a cap, but a wig grip is great, a great option. And I like the Velcro because you can adjust it. And we remember we don't do it too tight or we get a headache. So, oh, first peaks. Oh, this is a beautiful color. Dun dun. I know some of you don't come for me. I know who you are that don't like me in dark hair, but I was born with dark hair, so girl can't get out of, you can take the dark hair out of the girl, but you can't take the girl out of the dark hair, something like that. Oh, this is beautiful. Okay, so we're gonna put her on, and I'm just gonna get rid of this tag in the back. And let's talk about it. So it has bra clips for tightening, and we'll, we'll do it kind of medium, because we want it to fit nice. So these just slip in. This is a really nice feature, nice and comfortable. And this is how you can adjust it. Now this wig has hair clips in it. I'm gonna show you what that looks like. Let's get this untangled. Okay, this is straight out of the box, so thanks for bearing with me. It's gonna be a long video. Okay, and excuse the running nose. It's also cold here, you all know, you know. Okay, so this has a clip in the back. It's closed wefted, which means that the hair won't come back through. This looks hand tied, looks like, here's the lace front right here and the lace has not been cut. So we'll do that together. Here are the side combs. So if you don't have any hair, you'd probably wanna just use a seam ripper and take these off because they might be uncomfortable. Well, we'll know in a minute. And looks very nice, very soft. Let's put her on and see what she looks like. So when I put her on, you're gonna see the lace and. That's not how we wear her. We, um, we're gonna you know, cut the lace. This is a gorgeous color. I actually really like this color. Okay, so we'll put her head in and try her on. 
Okay, now I'm not used to, it's been a while since I wore a wig with a, oh, that cap fits amazing. The color is really beautiful. It's super soft. Oh my gosh, feels like baby fine hair. I, I guessed right, right on the part. So let's move that a little bit. It's got some highlights, it's beautiful. She's beautiful. Look at this. Now I know some of you don't like me in dark hair, but you know what? That's the beauty of wigs. We can change our mind, we can change it up all the time. I really like this. Look at the, the uh, part. I can barely see through this, this lace though, so it's pretty sheer. We're gonna cut the lace, we'll cut it together. But once we cut the lace, you know, it's gonna be where it is. But it's not scary, it's just, you just have to be careful. Really pretty waves. Now this is real hair, so um, if I were to go in humidity, it will respond to whatever the, the hair is, um, to humidity. Now these clips on the side, they're not uncomfortable. They feel, they. I can't, I don't notice them at all. I have that wig grip on. Beautiful, let me show you the back. Just a great length, really a great length for sweaters. I can see definitely going skiing in this wig. Really pretty, super pretty. Not too long, you know, sometimes I was kind of envisioning it being, you know, much longer, but I think I like this length. And I love the dark hair with my eyes. This is about the color I was born with. And y'all have seen me put on red haired wigs, so. Beautiful, thank you, Wig She. This is beautiful, just beautiful. She moves really well, not going anywhere. This is gonna stay on. And I think I'm a fan of human hair wigs. Let me know your thoughts.